Right, we're at um, a little village uh, called Seconton and this is an All Saints Church. This is um, a church with foundations and or building dating from the 13th century. Uh, it was extensively, should we say, extensively rebuilt in the Victorian period and um, lots of bits added on etc etc. In the, uh, the nave and the chancellery the windows are from 14th century and uh, the tower has various history as well. I don't know whether I can get inside but uh, this place, oops, excuse me, I'm walking around again. Um, in AD 757, uh, a chap called Athelbald, or Athelbald of Mercia was assassinated by his guards in Seconton. And this place is also in the Doomsday Book of 1086, and it records Seconton with a manor and five hides. Um, so, a lot of stuff, a lot of history. I don't know whether we can look inside. I don't know, it's probably locked. Welcome to All Saints. It looks so it's locked. Yeah. So, one of five churches within the parish of All Souls, North Warwickshire. And we are delighted to welcome you to our beautiful ancient building. The church is usually open on Saturdays throughout the year between 10 and 5. So that's not a problem. What the is there? Ah, oh, something. 1698. Sitting in there and carving your initials. Superb. Uh, some more history here. As you can see, I hope you can make out the the graffiti. <laughs> Early graffiti. Uh, there you go. So, back out again. I've got my glasses on you, so I can't walk around with my glasses on, I can't see. Um, an extremely large tower. As you can see. But, uh, beautiful place. Um, beautiful village, as you can see. Uh, not exactly a huge place. But uh, some large stones and a lot of other bits and pieces. So you can't really get the uh, size of the place unless you do a, a, some footage. So I might go up onto the main road, it's only a few yards away, and uh, fly over here. Um, but it is a little beautiful kept village um, with some really old looking properties. So Betty V doesn't look right here. As you can see, you hear the birds singing. Just little places everywhere. The old rectory that's a big place as well so must have some history somewhere along the line for the big uh, church like that cheers